Good afternoon, everybody. I realize the camera's not straight, or actually, maybe it's the maybe it's my poster that's behind us that isn't straight. All right, now that's better. So, <clears throat> I know I promised you guys a sewing video. Let me take these off of the lap. But a funny thing happened on my way home this morning between my two school runs. I decided to stop at Goodwill. So today's Tuesday, but I'm going to post this Wednesday. So if you watched my last video, you know I went to Goodwill yesterday. I spoke to the manager of Goodwill, who's really nice, and I said, you know, I'll make you a deal for all these patterns you have because these patterns have just been hanging out forever, and I proceeded to show you guys the patterns, right? So I wasn't going to go to Goodwill today, and I was like, I'm just going to stop in in case there were any patterns that she found later. Uh, on Tuesdays, you get senior citizens discount, and I am officially a senior citizen, um, which I don't really love that title. Um, <laughs> and anyway, so I went in and, you know, I was looking around. I figured, why the heck not? If I find something, I'll get a discount on it. So I walked back to where the patterns were, and there were no patterns. But what do my little blue eyes see? I don't know if you can see it. You can't really see it in the photo, so I'll have to pull it out. We'll start with the one that I saw first that immediately caught my eye. Yes, it is an entire bolt, still shrink-wrapped, of a novelty print fabric. And I'll tell you right now, I'm going to make it into a dress. If it was apples, I probably wouldn't have taken it. It's definitely a quilting fabric, but it is... Da -da -da -da, cherries. I'm going to take a picture of this for the thumbnail so you guys can get a real close up because it is the prettiest like aqua and cherry and white. So pretty. Bright red, you know, dark green, aqua and white. And it's kind of an off white and it's definitely a quilting fabric. I can tell by the salvage. In fact, let me open this up a little bit and see if I can see a date on the salvage. I don't see a date on the salvage, but... Still, I mean, it's gorgeous, right? And it was a whole bolt of fabric for $7.99. Yeah, I was like, you know that feeling when you get really excited and then you just start grabbing things? That's what I was doing. Um, and then there was this, and this is not a quilting fabric. This is an apparel fabric. It's, it's definitely a shirting material. It's very, it's much thinner than quilting fabric usually is. Probably 100% cotton. And look at that. And this much of a bolt. So I have no idea how much, but probably enough for a dress. That's all I'm saying. Probably enough for a dress. Maybe even a shirt. And this was $5.99? $6.99. Are you with me so far? And then I see this. This was $4.99. This is also not a quilting. This is lighter. This is also not a quilting fabric. This is, this feels like it could be like a poly cotton broadcloth, but look at it. Just a really beautiful basic navy. And again, look at how much is on that bolt. $4.99. And here's the last one I grabbed. There was some more, but it was orange and yellow and like a weird lime green and very modern and not really my colors. So this is, this is very lightweight. In fact, to me, it reminds me of Madras. It's got kind of a texture to it, but it's light. This was $6.99. And then I, I don't know why, but I grabbed this. <laughs> there was this one little thing in there. I, it's just two yards of red poly cotton fabric. Uh, it was $3.99. I don't know why I grabbed it. I At that point, I think I was like, I think I was kind of like, um, like fabric drunk. Like, you know, when you're just like, there's, you just want all the fabric. It's like when you've been doing too many shots and you're like, your friends are like, you need to slow down. And you're like, no, give me another shot. That's what I did with this. Um, but for $3.99, poly cotton, it's not, it's not great. It's not horrible. I don't know what I'm going to do with two yards, but it's a pretty red. Who knows? Maybe I'll use it to trim something else out. Use it pockets or who knows, right? A collar, something. Um, so with my senior citizens discount, this all came to tw like $28 and four cents, like some really strange amount. And I was just like, wow, 
like seriously. In fact, this one here, I'm thinking, this is so much fabric, this bolt, that I'm thinking that once I get done making whatever I want from it, like a dress, that I might share the wealth and put some of this on Etsy, um, sell some of the yardage on Etsy, just because honestly, it is so cool. In fact, now that it's out of the plastic, let me see if I can show you guys again so you can really get a good look. Look how gorgeous that is. And I've been wanting to do a novelty print dress for a while. You know, there's such a thing like a novelty print um, house dress. I even have a red metal zipper. It's really supposed to be for a jacket, but I'm kind of thinking it would be fun to do a novelty house coat and put a zipper down the front of it be kind of fun um so that's why i'm back i really do promise that i will do some sewing videos soon the problem is is another thing that happened today is the order that i did on facebook marketplace showed up so i want to show you guys that video so that may be a whole separate video or i want to show you guys that those patterns that may be a whole separate video and that lady was so nice. She told me there were 10 patterns. She ended up sending me 12. One of them had a dupe. And then there was a pattern she didn't list in the marketplace that she also sent me. And we had a really nice conversation. Maybe she was just, you know, giving it to me gratis because we had a nice conversation or whatever. But I'll take it. So, yeah, that's my update. And, and the thing is, is, I'm getting to the point now where it's like, so much fabric, so many projects, so little time. I have a month left of school. I know this because every day the kids tell me how many days we have left. We have 26 days left and every day they tell me how many days we have left. Um, which is, you know, the one thing that my kids and I can agree on is we would like school to end soon. So um, anyway, I am going to take a thumbnail of all of these together so you can really see, especially... The other one that's really beautiful, and I don't think the camera's doing it justice, was this stripe. It's hard to see, but the stripe actually has a little bit of purple in it also. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's so hard with lighting and these cameras to really get really precise um, images, but I'll give it a try with my phone. And yeah, the next video, which I'll probably do tomorrow, maybe post Friday, will be the lot that I did on Facebook Marketplace and those patterns so you guys can see them. All of which are going to go up on Etsy because really most of them aren't my size. So until the next video, please like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell because we know that I'm not great at scheduling things every day or every three days or however. The other way that you know most of the professional people on Facebook do. So it's always good to Ring the bell so you know when I repost it if you like watching my videos. And please comment. Love comments. And uh, until the next video, which will be the patterns, I hope you have a great day. It's really beautiful here. I'm making sun tea outside. It's such a warm, sunny day. And I hope it's lovely where you are. And have a great spring. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.